Oh my god. I can't believe I have been grounded by my stupid parents. I've had enough of this bullcrap. Anyways, what am I supposed to do? Well, maybe I should create a zombie clone machine. Wait, a zombie clone machine? My words gives me a perfect idea. Well, enough with that said. I am going to create my zombie clone machine in ruining the ghost city. So, they could be teach their lesson. <laughs> Now, here is the clone machine. Let's get inside to create a zombie clone of me. Well. Thing started. Kalu, what are you freaking doing? Go back to your room now. And stop faking your sick. Kalu, I said go back to your freaking room. Oh no, what just happened? Someone help. Oh no, boys. I'm out of here. Who can stop me now? Ha 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 Officer Allen, we've got to get out of here, but there is some things going on about SAT. And they turned into a kill zombies. But that little kid are going to be gone too far. Alright, let's go. We've reports of a little boy who has clones of his zombie self. But we have to turn everyone's back to normal. Trapped. Now what am I going to do? No, no, get the frick away of me. Why, where are we now? Hey Mr. Anderson, you're finally safe now. Oh wow, they are saved. Officer. We didn't expect you to see you there. We know, and we've got to tell you something. Your son Kailu has clone of his zombie self and trying to get revenge on him. We know. He's going to be grounded for this. Alright, you guys can go home. I will turn this anyone back to normal and get your son arrested. Alright, let's turn this anyone back to normal and get that little kid arrested. Good idea, let's go. Hi ha 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 There is no need to save Ha 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 Kailu, you are now coming with me and get in the police car. You're under arrest. Oh, oh, everything is back to normal. Now I'm so dead. Now this is your cell. You will be staying here and don't ever escape the jail until foot notice. So goodbye forever. Uh-huh. So you are the one who have a cloning of your zombie self and trying to turning everyone into your zombie self. Is this truth? Don't deny your wrongdoings, Kalo. Tell us the truth now. Well, um, I did. Because I want to get revenge all of them by turning into a my zombie self. Oh my freaking gosh, Kalo, are you out of your freaking mind now? You cannot believe you cloning of your 
your zombie self and tingling everyone and through your zombie self. You know you're not allowed to do that. This is very important and dangerous. That's it. You are so grounded, 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 grounded for 287 billion, 364 million, 243,836 years. Now stay in the jail and don't you ever escape until the COVID-19 is going away soon. So goodbye forever you jerk. This is the worst day of my life. And I can't believe I'm in the jail for cloning of my zombie self. Hey there. Do you want to hear Peggy Promise song? What? Who say that? It is me, Pinkie Pie. Now I'm going to sing Pinkie Promise theme song, so I hope you like it. No, not this song. Please turn it off. It's too cringy worthy. Please turn the goddamn off. I said turn the goddamn crap off. The song is getting old nowadays. Turn it off. You're making me hurt my feelings. I said turn it off. Please. I don't want to hear that crappy song anymore. Please turn it off. You hurted my feelings. Why are you making me upset? And I can't believe I you got missed it. I think it's funny. Anyway, goodbye. Oh my god, I'm so freaking bored today. Before I'll think about it, I'm going to see on YouTube. Okay. Let's go on YouTube to watch it. This will be fun. Man, all of these videos are boring. Now let's search on it. Aha, I found the YouTuber called Scott the Waz. Now let's go to his channel. Hey y'all, Scott here. What'll it be? Mario Party! This is the worst mode in any Mario Kart game, and it used to be my favorite Nintendo! What is wrong with you?! See, that should show you how bad this mode is, it made me break something. But I still did that out of anger towards Nintendo. Now, what the f*** am I doing? God. What am I supposed to watching this? This game review video is too cringeworthy. Well, I don't know how am I supposed to be revenge on that YouTuber. Let me think about it. Wait a second. I think I have a good idea. I'm going to crashing into Scott's house. But first, I'm going to steal my dad's car. So he could teach his lesson. Start the freaking car, you piece of shit. Ah, now the car is started. Now that's going to his house and crash them. Meanwhile. Well, I think it's time to do my new game review video. Okay. Now let's beginning this game review video. Hey all, Scott here. Hey, what the frick is that noise from? I'll go check outside. I need to check outside. Ha 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 ha. Take that Scott the Waz. I crashed into your house because you make a horrible game review video. This will be teach your lesson. Excuse me, little boy, who are you? And what have you done to my house? I'm actually KIU Junk. I've come here to crash into your house. Oh my freaking god! Halo, I can't believe you crashing into my house by interrupting me for making game review video. Thanks to you, my house is cost $900. Now who wants gonna help you to fix it? Nothing. That does it. Get out of my 
that site and I will call your parents. Oh, frick, 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 frick. Oh no, someone's calling me again. Let me answer it. Hello. Hello, Mr. Anderson. This is Scott the Waz. And today I am going to talk about your son what he did. Really? What did he do this time? Well, I caught your son Kalo stealing your car and crashing into my house. What? Oh my freaking god. He's so grounded for this when he gets home. Thanks for telling me this. Oh shoot. I have been caughted. Kalo. Did you stole my car and crashing into Scott's house? I just got a phone call from him. Tell me a truth. Um, yes. What? Okay. I can't freaking believe you stealing my car and crashing into Scott the Buzz's house. Now, my car is cost $350 because of you. That's it, little bald brat. You are grounded, 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 grounded forever until the corn of us would be gone. Now go upstairs to your freaking room and think about what you did. No, 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 no. God, what a brat. Oh my god, I can't believe Samster5677 keeps making grounded videos out of me. I mean no offense but grounded videos out of me is child abuse and he could get arrested in real life for that. So I want to get revenge on him for being child abuser. Kalu, what are you talking to? Nothing happens dad. Oh okay. If I see you, I'm warning you. Anyways, what should I do now? Oh, so that means I could make a prank video out of him. Even if April Fools is over, but not anymore. I'm going to make a fake apology video out of Samster5677. So, he could teach his lesson. Now, time to use Goat Animate Rapper and making fake apology video out of him. There, my fake apology video of Samster5677 is done. Now let's export this video on YouTube. Ha ha ha. I hope Samster5677 is gonna see this video and get triggered about this. Okay, time to go on YouTube and let's watch some other videos. Huh? What is this? <sighs> oh, I feel really bad for him, but I used to like making my Caillou gets grounded videos, but no, he already improved his behavior, I think I'm about to make my last Caillou gets grounded videos. Now I'm going to watch his apology video. Hey guys, it's me KIU, and today, I'm going to make the apology video of Samster5677. Okay, I will not going to being troublemaking days, look, I'm very sorry for being troublemaking days, I promise and I will never ever do that again. I hope you guys will forgive me, accept my apology and giving me a chance about this. What? I thought the video is real, but no. This is actually fake or psych video. You know what? I will never forgive him for making prank video out of me, and I'm still continued to make grounded videos out of him. I'm calling his parents about this. I'm gonna to see how the video is doing. Well, I got the 30,000 views on my new video. Now let me see the likes and dislikes. Um, why's my fake apology of Samster5677 video got a lot of dislikes? Let me read the comments and let's see what happens. Oh no, 
Samster5677 is gonna calling my parents about this, now I'm exposed. Hey! Get over here right now! We have a lot of explaining to do! Oh crap! Kalu, I just got a phone call from Samster5677 said that you made a fake apology video out of him. Is this really truth, Kalo? Don't even faking it. Okay, here's a truth. I made a fake apology video out of Samster5677. The reason why he keeps making grounded videos out of me non-stop. Please don't angry at me. What? Oh my freaking mother of gosh. Kalu. I can't believe you made a fake apology video out of Samster5677. You know making joke or fake apology video can anyone hurt their feelings just because what you did. Plus, Samster5677 will never forgive you. But it's permanently. That is so okay. You are grounded, 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 grounded for 273642364923423767 for two years. Now go back to your room and think about for nothing and don't ever come out to your room again <laughs> and stop being like a new oil actor. Well, let's see what's on the YouTube. I hope some gotards won't making grounded videos out of me. Wait, what is this? What kind of video is this? Rosie brings classic Caillou back to life. Slash. Ultimate grounding? Oh my god. I can't believe GoTube made a video about me like that. Even thought I like Rosie, but I really hate her so much. You know what? I have had enough of this stupid user. I'm going to kill him for freaking good. Let me find the weapon real quick. No, not this one. No, this is not a gun. Aha. Uh -huh. Got it. Okay, I finally found the pistol. Now let's go to the GoTube's house and waste him. Ha 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 ha. Ugh, that was a lot of running. After I made to his house, let's get inside and kill that idiot. Classic Caillou? What the frick are you doing here? And why did you kick the door into my house? Well go tube, since because I'm getting sick of tired of you for making video about me. Wait, what are you talking about? Why do you have a gun? That's really dangerous. Don't be stupid, that kind of thing only happens in the movies. In the movies. Movies. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> um, why is Cyan hit on his monitor and run away while he's screaming? Well forget about him, he's keep making grounded videos out of me non-stop. Dude. Put the gun away, this is a public building. I don't care about the public building, because you making video out of me non-stop. Say goodbye to you GoTube, aka, Luke. Prepare to die. Oh shoot, I forgot to load my ammo. Ha ha ha. Happy early joke fools. See? It's just a prank right? Look, don't you see the camera? Look at the camera, it's just a prank. Oh my god. Classic Caillou, how freaking dare you trying to kill me when you said April Fools. You know it's not April Fools day. That's it. I'm calling your parents about this. Oh crap 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 crap. Why a way, 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 a way
Jesse, me and your mother are going to the movie to watching Aquaman. So, we decided to hire a babysitter. Well, is it going to be Kalu, Ariel, Noya, or anything else? Yeah. Is it going to be anything else, Mom and Dad? We don't know who will it be, Jesse. Well, if we don't have a babysitter, can we go into the movies with us? Monkey's right. Mom and Dad, please, can we go in with you? Please, please, please. But unfortunately, Jesse, we're not going with you two, because it is COVID-19, and you should be stay home until the virus will end on next year. But, make sure you two behave. Oh, there's the babysitter. Come here. Oh my god, is it Henry Stickman? I'm sure it is Jesse. Monk, and Jesse, me and your father are going to the movies. But you two should be behave, okay? Okay, mom, we'll be behave. Okay, I'm gonna go now, I love you. I love you too, mom. Oh my god, I remember that song before. Same here, my sis. Well then, let's join that person and dancing each other. One second later. Ugh, Jesse, I think we should stop dancing, because we're so tired. Yeah, let's tell Henry to stop dancing. Hey Henry, should we stop dancing right now? Because we need a rest. Um. Henry. Henry, are you freaking hear us? We said we have to stop dancing and we need a freaking rest. Okay, that idiot Stickman will never listen to us. Then why don't you just raging at him by forcing him to stop dancing? That's a good idea, Jess. Let's do this. Oh my god! I love you freaking times to say! We said stop dancing and we need a freaking rest! But you didn't listen to us! So stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it! Stop it. Oh great, that didn't work at all. Wait a minute, what happened to my body? Something is gonna happen again. Same with me, Monk. This guy needs to stop dancing before we're going to dancing again. Oh no, we're dancing again. Now we can't stop dancing before he learned his lessons. We don't know how could we stop him. There, and do not ever control us to dancing again. Come on, Jesse, we have to run. What should we hide for Monk? Well, we should hide in the room, so he will never see us again. Phew, that was closed. Well, let's hope he will never see and dancing with us. Yeah, I think so. Let's be quietly. <laughs> he coming after us? Let's just run. Lock the door, now. Nine one one. what's your emergency? Hey, ah, uh, 911. Something is wrong with him. I think that stickman's gonna control in us to dancing each other. He coming after us again. You know, screw it. Let's get in there. We can't. Because the vent is too short. Oh Monk and Jesse, we are home. Yes. We're saved. So, how is your babysitter? I'm too scared, Dad. Because Henry was controlling us to dancing each other. But we're tired to stop him. When I try to tell him to stop dancing, he never listen our advice, so that's why. Ah. It's okay, my daughter. We're still here with you. And I know you've been scared about babysitter Henry Stickman. Yeah, Henry Stickman looks awesome. Don't you, Monk? 
Um, yes, I do like Henry Stickmin. Hey look, it's Henry. Let's dancing each other. Well that was weirdo. Well then Monk, let's dance each other with Henry and my mom and dad. Sounds good idea. Let's dance. Oh, yeah! It is a beautiful day, I've ever seen it before. And I really love to take a walk to the park. Okay, enough with that said, I'm going to school because I'm getting late. Oh my freaking god, Jesse, will you please watch where you're going? It hurts so badly. Oops, sorry, Mom. I was accident. Oh, it's okay then, but don't ever do that again. Oh, um, are we going to the movie? No. Fun. No. Or games. Jesse, cut it out. We're going to the school before we're getting late and that is final. Okie dokie. Alright then class, today, we are going to learning about another math problems. That's right. <coughs> what? Another math again? Oh come on Miss Martin, can you please stop learning about the math problems? It's so stupid. Silent Bob. Anyways, I wonder where is Monk and Jesse go? Oh look, they are here now. We're here guys. Sorry we're late. Oh, that's okay then Monk, but now, take your seat. But anyways students, let's get this math started then. Now, the question is... What is 5 plus 10? It's easy to us. Yes, Mikkel? 15. That's correct. Anyways, let's move on. Hey, Maggot. Excuse me, Bob, why would you throw the paper ball on my back? Oh, don't worry about it, Maggot. I have the right to throw the paper ball at you. Oh yeah. You throw the paper ball at me. Hey, do you realize that it is really cyberbullying? Blah, blah, blah. I'm going to bully you by throw the paper ball at you. Up. Don't you ever dare to throw the paper ball in the class, because if you do that, then you will seriously get expelled for life. Oh, okay. We'll see about that. Come on class, don't be shy. Just give it your best shot. Excuse me, anyone, who ever throw the paper ball at me? Oh, well, um... Monk is the one who threw the paper ball at you, Miss Martin. I am very dead serious. Not gonna lie. That's a freaking lie. He was trying to frame me for throw the paper ball at you to get me in trouble. And Bob tries to lie to you. Shut up, you liar. You actually did it, not me. Monk, how could you throw the paper ball at me? I thought you're a nice person and better than this, but no. You actually ruining my reputation. But uh, Ms. Martin, I didn't do it. It was Bob is the one who brainwashing you and thinks that I throw the paper ball at you to get me in trouble. But please don't hate me for this. I already accept my wrongdoings, and Bob is the one who framing me. I don't give a crap you liar. Now get to the principal office right now, or I will send you to the detention. Monk, are you okay? Hey Beth, can you tell me what happened to my brother? Well, you're not going to believe this Jesse, he, threw the paper ball at me, and denying his wrongdoings. So that's why. Well, I guess I am going to talk to him real quick. Monk, what's wrong? Just don't talk to me sis, I'm very sick of that fat guy. Forget me in trouble by Ms. Martin, but I didn't even throw the paper ball at her. And I can't take this anymore, because it's all Bob's fault for ruining my feelings.
brother. Just listen to me. I know you didn't do it. It was Bob is the one who framing you by throw the paper ball at Ms. Martin to get you in trouble. I'm just here to cheer you up. But don't worry, Monk. I will tell Ms. Martin that you didn't do it. It was by the name of Bob. Well, thank you, sis. You cheered me up. Now let's hope Bob will teach us lesson. That's too good here, Monk. Now let's get this fat guy out of here. Hey! You two? What do you think you're doing? Well, 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 little girl. Why do you cheer your brother up? You know he's throwing the paper ball at Miss Martin and demanding his wrongdoings. What? I was the one who threw the paper ball at Miss Martin to get your brother into a trouble. Ha 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 ha. Well, 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 now you are the one who did this to my brother. Okay, man. Here goes nothing. Oh my freaking god, you mother FSCFXCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFCFC
like, like what the frick, I can't believe my sister Jessie beat the game, except me, it's too hard to beat the game. You know what? I'm going to beat the game myself so I can do this. Green, green, what, what is your problem, green? What is your problem? This side alone ram, this side alone ram. I'm so done with it. He looks so mad though. Well, that was weird. Monk has quitting playing among us because he failed to beat the game. But who cares anyways? I am going to cling among us no matter what. Uh oh, I smell like a monk's computer is on fire. Now what am I going to do about my brother's computer? Oh ha, I think I have an idea. I'm going to delete the system 32 files so I can make my brother's computer faster. Okay then, time to delete the system 32 file to make Monk's computer fast. Twenty minutes later. And voila! The system32 file is deleted, so I have to turn off the computer and make Monk's computer feeling better. Gotta go! Okay, now this is my last chance. I will not going to Regina Among Us ever again. But anyways, let me turn my computer on. What? My computer is no longer able to start. I'm gonna tell my parents about my computer is broken. Mom, Thab, can you please come over here please? What is it son? Someone just deleted system 32 file. Now my computer is no longer to boot. Oh dear honey, we're very sorry to hear that. We don't know who deleted the system 32 file on your computer. Don't worry son, we will buy a new one. Wait a minute, I think my sister Jessie is the one who ever deleted system 32 file on my computer. I'm going to tell her real quick. Whoa son, don't be mad, your sister said it was all just a joke. Jessie, come into my room right now. We have a lot of explaining to do. Well, 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 mom, what happened? Can you please explain this what happened to my computer? It got risked. But mom, it was just a joke. Our parents will buy a new one for you, and I didn't mean to delete system 32 file on your computer. Your sister is right, Monk. Please learn how to handling jokes. It's just a prank at all, Monk. We're not trying to be mean to you. Yeah, but please do not be rude to your sister. She's a good girl and you can respect your own sister. You know what, Jesse? I've had enough of you for doing this. Jesse, what the frick is wrong with you nowadays? I cannot actually believe you believe system 32 file on my computer and make my computer risk. Also, deleting system 32 is not a joke, it's a serious deleting anything. You know what Jesse? I'm done, I'm so freaking done with you right now. But now, it's permanent late. And if you think about your story, your apology will be permanent in tonight. And I'll never respect for you ever again. Now, get the heck out of my room. But my I thought you oh, no no bucks. Get out, and I'll never respect you ever again. Also, I will never forgive you. Wow monk, just freaking wow. You disrespected to your own sister. And that is not very nice to denying Jesse's apology. This proves you can't handling pranks and jokes at all. So why did you do that to your own sister? Well it's because my sister Jessie deleted system 32 file on my computer and losing all of my hard work files. Oh, and if you two are claims that denying apologies ruining reputation, it's 100% not. Denying apologies are for criticism purposes only. So that's why I will never forgive her because she makes my computer risk and losing all of my files. Okay young boy, and guess what? You're grounded for disrespect to your own sister. Now stay in your room, and don't come out until you're apologizing to your sister.
then. I feel bad that I yelled at Jessie. I didn't mean to hurt her feelings because she deleted system 32 file on my computer and losing all of my hard works. Since my parents grounded me, I'm going to apologizing to my sister Jessie. Hey sis. Please go away, monk. You ruining my reputation? No Jess, I'm not trying to ruin your reputation. I just want to tell you something. I mean, yeah, you are a cute girl, you know. Wait, really? Yeah, and I am very sorry for raging at you and ruining your reputation. The reason why I was upset, because my computer got risk, and also, it's just a computer. My parents can take me to buy a new one, and I am so sorry for disrespecting you. Well then, does that mean I'm forgiven? You know monk. Yes. Apology accepted. I'm glad you hear that. Now, come here. We're so glad to hear that you apologizing to her monk. Thanks mom. I really appreciate it. Mom, Dad, I have a question. What is it son? Well you might be ask, am I no longer to be grounded? To be honest son, you are no longer be grounded for apologizing to your own sister, but make sure you behave, okay? Okay Dad, I understand now. I'll be behave. That's too good here son. Come on. We're going to buy a new one for you. The matter monk well jess it looks like we need to go get something to eat because i was hungry oh and i'm very hungry too so what are we going to eat i have an idea should we going to the go foods instead like sure why not oh there it is now monk what should we order for anything we want jess now let's order some foods <laughs> I wish I could make a flesh of people. Because I love to kill someone and cook these things. Ahem. I'm coming. Oh hi, you two. Welcome to the Go Foods. May I take your order? Hey, uh, we will like have a cheeseburger. Oh, oh, and I will have a cheeseburger too. Just like my brother. So which drink we get? A milkshake. We will have a two milkshakes. And two cheeseburgers. Alrighty then. Your foods will be here in three minutes. Now go over seat until the food is ready. Since Monk and Jesse ordered ordered some foods, I'm going to put this poison bottle into a milkshake and cheeseburger. So, that means, I'm going to cook them. Wow, that taste looks delicious. Don't you, Jesse? Yeah, it's so delicious. Well then, Jess, what are we gonna do next? Oh no, I think something's wrong with me. Heh, what's the matter? I think I feel drunk. Oh, no, see what? Me, I think we're going to. Mom. 
Monk. Monk, get up! What? What the hell happened? Well, it looks like the Go Foods is now closed tonight. It's too dark in here. But we have to get out of here because I'm so scared. Huh? Where is everyone going? They left. Oh, Monk, I don't want to stay in here because I'm so scared. Don't worry about it, my cute sis. I'm still here with you. We have to get out of here before my parents miss us. Crap, it's locked. But we're about to try the another door. It's locked again. Now we can't escape this. So, what are we gonna do now? <laughs> what was that noise about? What, 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 what is that? Don't worry, Jess. I'll protect you. <laughs> Jesse? Jesse? Oops, sorry, I was screaming too loud. Well, if you don't know how, I don't think that's Danny Phil, I think it was. Ronald McDonald. Wait, how did you know that? I just found out that he impersonated him to get him into a trouble. Oh, now he's so dumb meat. Well, I see you Ronald, you're the one who impersonated Danny. Oh, nice. You both are caught at me, I only want to killing people and fleshing everything else to do. Oh, so are you trying to flushing me? No, you are not going to flushing me, because you are such an adult. Huh. Really? I have to write for killing and fleshing people whatever I want. And this wee monk. Now I am going to fleshing you. Prepare yourself. Oops, I am so excited they're going to five. Nothing personal, kid. Yeah. My bad. Nobody cares if you hit your back. Watch out! 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 There, that should be teach your own. Any last words, kid? I've been shot. Mandy, you're here. Thank freaking god Mandy, you saved me. Yeah, that's what he get for flushing people on the go foods. So, I wonder what was that noise? Oh, I think my sister Jessie was the one who playing that sound effect. Oops. Sorry, I was playing a crowd sound effect. Wait, how do you girls know me? Well, it's because I remember you since Ronald McDonald was the one who impersonated you. Yeah, that's what he get for winning our customers. Okay Danny, you are free. Thank you guys so much for saving me from that evil name Ronald McDonald. You guys are the best. You are welcome, Mr. Phil. Alright, so who wants to join the party? You bet. <laughs> Interrupt your Windows form Pearl Jabred error. Jabred has taken over for unknown reasons. Attention, don't turn off the computer. Repeat, don't turn it off to your computer. If you turn off your computer, you will losing your chances and you will get jump scared. So, good luck with this error.
Alright. But remember, I'm watching you. And don't even think turning off your computer. Oh, I saw you've turned off the computer once, but don't do it again, you will have ninth chances. You did it again. Okay listen, this isn't what it looks like. This is your two times you've turned off. You have eighth chances. What the, oi, what the heck are you doing? Can you just stop turn it off your computer? You have seven chances left. So, don't you, ever, press the shutdown button. Hey, I'm warning you. Okay, that's freaking enough. You're starting to making me piss me off. I swear, you have six chances left. If you turn it off one more time, I will be evil mode, so don't you dare. Right, that's it. You refused by not listening to me. Stop turning off your computer. Also, you have fifth chances left. Oh my god! You turned off again six times. Now the background has changed the color. That's it. You have fourth chances left. So don't you dare. What have you done? Now the background color has changed the gray. So, don't do it again. You have third chances left. What the f are you not listening to me? Okay, you asked for it. You have second chances left. If you turn it off eight times, you will get jump scared. to play a game with you. Now, this is your final chances. If you're turning off your computer ten times, and you could get top scared. Finally, school is finished. I'm looking forward to Christmas. With only one month before Christmas, I can acquire any Christmas presents I want. So how do you feel? I feel like I could receive everything I want for Christmas. I'm looking forward to Christmas. Yeah, me too. Why is it that everyone seems to be ignoring us? No one is going to adopt us like this now. Calm down, Carl. We'll simply have to wait till they recognize and adopt us. Hold on a second. Uh, excuse me. Oh my, my lovely lost sister. Oh my god! Carl? Damn, I thought you're dead. Oh don't worry, my sister Susan is the one who uses a potion to bring me back to life. Wait, I don't get it, did Carl lie about being in a car accident? No, I was the one who revived him with a potion, but hey, my name is Susan, and it's lovely to meet you. Monk Morrison. Good to see you Monk, is it acceptable if Carl and I get adopted? What do you mean? Well, many years ago, my terrible parents drank too much alcohol, causing them to abuse me. Carl, and even Jesse, 
and they won't leave us alone. Not to add that they falsely accused Jesse simply because she cheated on her test, while she did nothing wrong because she had previously passed the test. Is it alright if Carl and I are adopted? We're homeless, and no one is going to adopt us. Damn, I feel so bad for you Susan, I'm very sure your aggressive parents drink alcohol. Therefore they're going to mistreat you. But hey, I'm here to adopt both of you. Wait, are you serious? Yes, I was adopted Jessie last year, and her abusive parents got arrested. Yeah, whomever perpetrated the crimes of child abuse was an alcoholic psychopath. What happened to your old house? We've opted to shift to this new one because it was destroyed. Stay right here, and I'll go talk to Mogon right away. Mogon I have some. Mogon what are you watching? Uh, I'm watching PewDiePie. Mug what happened? Mogon caught in 25k to HDR 900 gigabytes per maps from iOS 100 AMCI Max 2840p Grand Theft Auto 5 Realistic Graphic PlayStation 5. Wait, I can explain. <laughs> So, are you two here because you've both been adopted? Yes, our alcoholic parents are abusing us since we've done nothing wrong. I believe my elderly parents are alcoholics and are planning to murder us. What is this? That is a voice change gun. Wait a minute, who changed my voice? Whoops, sorry my bad. Let me change your voice back. Well I guess that means my voice has returned to normal. Wait a minute, why has my voice been back to its previous state? What? Mogon do you still have Ella voice bottle? Expired. Never mind, I'm just going to maintain my previous voice. Okay whatever. So, when Susan and I have been adopted, which one should I sleep with in my new bedroom? It's in the two vacant bedrooms on the upstairs. You two are welcome to enter. Wow. This space appears to be one of my favorites. I wish I could spend more time here. Okay, please make a promise to me and don't ever snitch on Jesse. Ever again. Now don't worry, I've got my adopted sister Susan. Isn't Jesse your adoptive sister? Huh, yeah, I was adopted her when I was a kid last year, and have you been in a car accident? Yes, but Susan brought back to my life a day ago. Makes sense. Guys. Susan what happened? I think I have a problem. What is it? You're not gonna believe what just happened? I. Just. Saw. Our new parents were kidnapped by our nasty drunken parents. As well as Jesse. What? Well 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 Mr. Morrison, do you believe that taking my daughter Jesse is the same as adopting her? You didn't even give my kid permission to be adopted. You've just gotten us in trouble by having us arrested for child abuse. You should be aware that Jesse has cheated on his tests in the past. We've had it with both of you for stealing my daughter. What's going on? Where's Jesse? We've put her in the closet and locked the door. Me, Carl, Susan, let me out of here. I'm trapped in the closet. Don't worry Jess, I'll let you out of here as soon as possible. What are you doing to my sister and how did you manage to get out of jail? Oh, you're curious as to why? The cops release us from jail so that everyone can trust us and we may become happier person. That's a lie. You escaped from prison yourself, and you're nothing more than an alcoholic and a child abuser who committed a terrible crime by attempting to murder Jesse. She's right, you're very cruel to my sister Jessie because you made tiny faults like lying about being slain by special weapons and tactics. Don't argue with us young man. We're going to give you a lesson now. Don't worry baby, let me handle this. Now, listen to me you little foolish brat. You should know that Jessie did it on purpose in the past, and this demonstrates that you're defending and snatching my daughter. I'm going to cut off all of your fingers to teach you a lesson. What do you think about that? It's good for you, but don't say it's terrible, or I'll chop it off again. Oh my god, my finger. Is it good for you or not? No. Yes, it's really good for you. And don't worry, I hope you will learn your own lesson. Hey, stop doing this to my brother. Oh my god, Jesse. 
Nice try Jesse, you attempted to hit me in the face. If you dare to hit me, you will be grounded and punished when we get home. Never. Fine. Ah! Get off you dumb prick. Hold on Jimmy, let me help you. Hey, let me go, get off my face. Let me go you with your blast. You okay mom? I'm sure your hand was hurt. No, my pain we got cut. Uh. That would be okay bro, let's hope your hand gets well. Yeah, hope you feel better. Get off my face you weirdo. So, you think you'll get away with it so you've attempted to murder Jesse? Hey look it's Mogon, we're saved now. Oh come on. Don't you know Jesse has done it before? She'll be grounded for this. Well Mr. Jimmy and Ms. Zoe, I think it's time to send you two to the Brazilian police station, which means you're going to jail. I'll send you to the airport and you'll be on your way to Brazil. No! 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 So you think we'll bail you out of jail and let you get away with it? You're traveling to the police station in Brazil to send the prisoner. Oh come on officer, we don't want to go to the police station in Brazil. If we go to Brazil, everyone will call us pedophiles. Well that's too bad, you're traveling to Brazil together, you foolish child abusers. Have fun in Brazil for attempting to assassinate Jesse. Do you want to switch back to a new voice Jess? Now that's okay. I'll simply have to preserve my old voice. Hey, we're wondering where our new 